Peggy 3. Sports car racing for me is, it's been my home. It's what I grew up watching. It was a dream to go racing. I feel like that there's definitely a part of my driving that was developed in sim racing. The discipline needed to be good in racing. You can learn that and hone that skill in Russia Cars too. Amazing though, at the end there, like around the hairpin, the sun is peeking in, you know, around. That makes you feel like you're there, yeah. for sure. Yeah. It's Unbelievable. Crazy. One thing that's interesting about Slightly Mad Studios is that the founders of the company all started doing amateur racing game mods. And we'd make our own cars, we'd make our own tracks, we'd make our own interfaces. All this stuff was happening. It was a very exciting time. And there was this kid named Turbo Tom, as he was known in the forum. <laughs> Yeah, Turbo Tom, that came from early on when I was 11, 12 years old, and I thought, oh, this cool name, Turbo Tom. Here's this young kid who we knew wasn't racing cars, but he was involved with the sim racing scene, and he would test our mods out, and he'd give some feedback, but in general, he was a fan of what we did. I got hooked right away. Mod groups would sort of come around, and I volunteered oftentimes to help with them try to make the cars better. Then we heard a few years later that Turbo Tom had started racing cars. So Tommy Milner himself has grown up and become a professional racing driver at the same time the, that we grew up and became professional video game developers. An excellent win for the Corvette of Garcia, Milner, and Barretta. Having done sim racing for so long, blending what I learned into real life helped me prepare for racing with Corvette. When you work on different types of racing games, uh, you, you can see that there's different philosophies with different game studios. So for us, it's most important that the racing drivers are there from the get-go. And Tommy has had a big effect on the overall handling of the race cars in game. Hearing quite a bit of surveillance in the car, getting into the corner, so that's where some of that front grip feeling kind of comes from. Having been a part of Project Cars 2, it's been a lot of fun for me and rewarding to see how far the sim has come. I'm having the most fun I've ever had driving sims because I'm driving it, criticizing every little detail, trying to figure out how do we make this perfect. I'm Tommy Milner, and I'm a two-time Le Mans champion.